All right, y'all. Second job of the day of three. And this particular customer just bought the house. It's not a brand new house, of course, but you know, when you buy something, you probably hope it'll be clean. Look at the walls, carpet. They said the carpet was was clean, at least that's what he told me over the phone, but he said that there's a uh, a smell when he sleeps. And when I did the uh, when I did the inspection with the light. We can see some urine right by his bed. And a couple spots here and there throughout the rest of the uh, the house where the carpet's at. So we're just gonna treat the entire carpet. You never know what, you know, sometimes you can't see, you know, urine in the carpet sometimes. So, you know, I've, I've even went behind someone that, or, you know, like the, the, the customer, like, oh, you know, I know my dog went to the bathroom on the carpet right here. And then when we look on um, with the light, I can't, I don't see it. And I think what happens is when you try to clean it right away, we don't really see anything because most of it's been kind of mopped up, but there's still urine right there and it still may have a little smell especially in like the uh, padding but you guys can see this so we definitely got some stains um i don't know man we see it all the time realtors they're they're let's get the cheapest cleaner in here let's you know let's skimp out so we can make more money i've had realtors call me up and I give them the price and they say, well, you know, my client doesn't have a lot of money. Like, dude, they're about to sell a house and these houses out here are close to like, you know, they're like 800, 800 and up, you know? So it's like somebody about to have some money. You got to have, you know, especially if you clean it right, you're going to have more to work with. But let me set this up. Let me put this away. And, and I'm gonna start uh, setting up for a, uh, a, you know, a treatment for the carpet. All right. All right. So just looking at it, you guys can kind of see what's going on over here. His bed was in the middle. I slid it over. Fairly lightweight. That thing blows, boy. Gosh, I love it. <laughs> But, uh, so you see how when I put this over here, it's more purple. Then I start getting over here, it starts to get a little bit more. The, uh, that bluish color that urine turns because this is a should be purple you know what I'm saying like and then what we got in here are some uh, some cleaning products because this is a bluish color the uh, those right there but super hard to see because it's, it's bright in here um, but if we look over here, same thing. Man, it's hard to see. I mean, I don't have it on, but it's kind of dark in the middle. You see what I'm saying? Like, if it gets darker in here, which we had the blinds closed earlier. You can kind of see what we're seeing. So 
again, that comes down to whatever I can't see. I just want to make sure I spray the entire room. Um, but like over here, it's too bright. Um, there really wasn't anything on the stairs. Um, and if we run downstairs, let's just make this, I'm trying to make a video too, because the customer's not here. That way we can have some form of transparency. Um, you know, I don't want to be that type of company that just comes in and comes out. You know what I'm saying? Like get in, get out. We're going to show you exactly what we did around here. So this room's, of course, darker. The uh, blinds are closed, but it is still a little bit bright. But you can see some stuff going on up in here. All right. So it's definitely there. Um, like I said, I'm just going to spray everything. Sometimes you can't see it, see it sometimes. So that's how we're going to take care of that. I didn't really see anything on the stairs, but, you know, we'll make sure it's well taken care of. It's d West for life, y'all.
All right, y'all, so I've just been getting at it. It's looking a lot better in here. Um, so both jobs today have been like pet treatment, deodorizers, and so get, I'm getting my uh, my quota for the for the month. <laughs> Some of the the last one was super potent. Thank God this one's not not bad. Carpet look white again. Look good, uniform, groomed. That's what we go for around here. So especially like when he comes back home, he can walk in, see some nice, good, clean carpet. Who knows what those spots could be, but you know, sometimes when you spot clean, you're doing a, you're making the carpet worse. So they probably could have spot cleaned some areas. I'm not saying I'm, I know 100% sure that, you know, that's what happened, but sometimes that's what it is. Looking good, y'all. Just had to take a call, book another one for uh, Sunday. So, so far, man, we've been, like I got three today, that tells you what's going on. But it's not like that all the time, so I wanna make sure I take advantage. I'm gonna put some post treatment over uh, these uh, these two big areas, uh, this one and then the one in the bedroom, just so there's an, uh, a little bit more on there. A little dry stroking, and then I'll see you guys downstairs. This is D West for life, y'all. Right, y'all, last room.
It's looking good. Everything's looking good. I heard y'all want to see that kick. I do it. I just, even like when I first started, I didn't like to show what I'd be doing because people wouldn't be like, man, this dude is weird. <laughs> but really, I only do it when I uh, have the camera, the phone in my hand when I'm recording because I usually use the handle. And you guys know I like them straight lines. So it was kind of hard for me to even figure out how to do both at the same time so I started doing this little kick thing and it's been it's been that D West signature for shoot what are we on a little over three years now you guys can see what it looks like in here it looks pretty good as far as uh, remember that front area was pretty pretty dark had a few stains That's just my hose hitting the door. It's got like these random black marks around here. It's the weirdest thing. And they don't even move. Like, And when I say move, I mean like they're not showing signs that they want to come out. It's almost like someone tried to uh, spot treat or something or it's like a permanent marker or something and then they just set it in. But I did use, uh, I have my uh, ink remover with me. I tried it on a few spots. There was a blue spot in the, uh, in the hallway upstairs. It didn't budge at all. Just a little topple in this area, like the areas where it was dark or where we saw some urine at. Oh yeah, I'm running. <laughs> Alright, so. That's the one blue mark. Looking a lot better over here. You know, just spritz a little bit over the top. 